Hi guys, today we are talking about 10 signs your kidneys are trying to tell you something. Here are 10 indicators that something is wrong with your kidneys. The craziness of daily life make it far too simple to get caught in. The fact that our bodies are constantly working in our drive to carry out many tasks and simply keep us alive is something we rarely pose to think about. When something is not functioning properly, your body literally cries out for help. And the consequences of ignoring these signals can be severe. The following list of 10 symptoms suggest that your kidneys are not functioning properly provided by your health matter and please watch the video all the way to show your support for these bean-shaped organs and to find out how your kidneys are doing. Number 10. Sleep Disturbances Let's first explain what the kidneys actually do. They are in charge of expelling toxins from the body through the urine. Therefore, you may think of them as the body's version of a garbage collector. If they are not working properly, those offer toxin remain in the body and the blood. Sleeping is extremely difficult when your body is overloaded with toxins. Thus, insomnia could be an indication of kidney issues. Of course, it is understandable if you have a busy day or drink more coffee than usual. But, if nothing in your routine has changed and you find yourself lying in bed counting sheep over and over again, you may want to have your kidneys examined. And by the way, persons with chronic renal disease frequently experience sleep apnea, a disorder in which breathing actually stops during sleep, even while it is only lasts for a little period of time before returning to normal breathing with a loud snort it is still very frightening. So, if you are someone who know snores loudly, it might be a time to visit the doctor. Number 9. Headache, fatigue, and general weakness. Red blood cells transport oxygen throughout the body, which keeps you feeling energized. Of course, you become tired faster if you have less red blood cells. Red blood cells are now produced by a hormone called EPO, which also creates these hormones. You understand what healthy kidneys do, right? In order to maintain healthy bones and produce EPO, it passes vitamin D. Therefore, you should visit a doctor if you suddenly started feeling really fatigued. You should also be aware that anemia, which happens when a person has between 20 and 50% of normal kidney function, is a typical complication for patients with chronic renal disease. If you are receiving enough rest and sleep, but you are still feeling worn out or fatigued all the time, schedule an appointment with a doctor right away. Down to number 8, Dry Itchy Skin as you are already aware, healthy kidneys perform fantastic tasks by eliminating waste and excess fluid from the blood, assisting in the protection of red blood cells and preserving the proper level of minerals in your body. Dry, itchy skin may indicate that your kidneys cannot maintain the proper balance of minerals and nutrients. The bone disease may follow this mineral deficit and nobody wants that. Now, if you have dry itchy skin, you should try to keep hydrated and don't even consider taking any anti-itch medications before talking to your doctor. Some medicines chemicals can potentially harm your kidneys even more. Number 7. Bad breath and metallic taste in the mouth. When the blood is excessively clogged with waste, you may experience a metallic taste in your mouth that affects how you taste the food. I don't know about you, but I prefer the taste of my food to be phenomenally amazing rather than metallic. Another indication that there are too many toxins and other types of pollution in the bloodstream is unpleasant breath. Tic Tacs won't help with that. I agree. Another use is that people lost their appetite overall, especially for meat due to the increased toxins level. And obviously, a decrease in hunger results in unhealthy losing of weight. Remember that there are other factors including allergies and poor dental health that can cause food to taste metallic. Normally, if the suspected source has been removed, 
the metallic taste in the tongue should disappear. Go with your physician if the taste persists. Number 6. Shortness of breath. It may come as a surprise, but renal illness and having trouble breathing are related. There are two basic causes. The first is that extra fluid that the kidneys are unable to easily clear enters the lungs. In addition to kidney failure, second is anemia, deprive the body of oxygen and causes shortness of breath. Lung cancer, heart failure, and asthma are just a few of the various causes of shortness of breath. Running to catch the bus to Atlanta, so if you find it difficult to breathe, it may not necessarily indicate that you have kidney issues. Perhaps you are simply a homebody who needs to get up, move around more, and eat less donut. But where's the fun in that? However, if you notice that you continually get out of breath while performing simple things like feeding your dog or going to the kitchen, you have to consult your doctor immediately now. Number 5. Swelling in the hands, feet, and ankles. We now know that kidneys that are not functioning properly when they don't get rid of excess fluid from the body. This fluid accumulation may cause sodium retention, which results in ankle, foot, and hand swelling. Swelling in the lower body may also be an indication of liver or heart disease, as well as leg vein issues. Sometimes, removing excess fluid from your body with medicine helps reduce swelling, but we strongly advise consulting a doctor first before purchasing any such medication. Kidney issues are already dangerous enough. You don't need to worry about any strange side effects on top of that. Taking medication without a prescription might also cause cough concerns. The fact that you might be hiding symptoms that would typically aid in a proper diagnosis make it much more difficult for your doctor to make a diagnosis. Number 4. Backache Given that your kidneys are located in the back of your body, this may not come as a surprise. Usually, deep and situated just below the ribs, back discomfort from the kidney disease can also reject to the front of the groin or the hip region. Kidney cysts, which are big fluid-filled sac produced on the kidneys as a result of a polycystic kidney disease, may be the source of back and leg pain. And there is something else you should know about back pain when it is caused by renal difficulties in those experiencing back sore. I am sure the more sensitive viewers out there are probably scheduling a doctor's appointment, but hold on that for a second. Always keep an eye out for high temperatures, frequent vomiting, and urination. If you don't experience any of these symptoms, you are either in the clear or you are dealing with issues unrelated to your kidneys. And normally, back pain which is distinct from kidney discomfort is more localized, occurs suddenly, and it is not accompanied by temperature. However, if you experience back pain frequently and medication is not helping, arrange an appointment with your physician. Number 3. Puffy eyes. Puffy eyes are a warning indication of renal disease. The kidneys may leak a lot of protein into the urine rather than storing it and distributing it uniformly throughout the body if the kidney's filtration function is damaged. And, as you might have guessed, this regenerate protein will make the area around the eyes puffy. So, if you are absolutely certain that your body is getting enough rest and sleep, and you are absolutely certain that you have not been crying during a particular movie, seen in a romantic comedy or family film, but you still notice puffiness around your eyes, make an appointment with your doctor right away. Number 2. High Blood Pressure Your circulatory system and kidneys are connected to and completely dependent on one another, much like a yin and yang. Small nephrons in the kidneys filter waste and excess fluid from the circulation. 
high blood pressure is the second most common cause of kidney failure because damaged blood arteries prevent the nephrons that filter your blood from receiving enough oxygen and nutrients. It is possible to control your excessive blood pressure and prevent renal failure. Adding folic acid rich food to your diet will help you avoid anemia since folic acid aids in the synthesis of red blood cells. Among the foods that are high in folic acid include leafy greens, citrus fruit, cereals, rice, and pastas. Number 1. Change in Urination As unpleasant as it may sound to inspect your urine, do not dismiss any changes in the frequency, smell, color, or appearance of your urination. In our discussion of how our kidneys are in charge of making urine and removing waste through it, we mentioned that the first sign to look for it is a change in urination. Here are three most typical forms of alterations. First, a greater desire to urinate particularly at night time. If you don't drink more than usual, anywhere from 4 to 10 times each day is seen as typical. Observing blood in pee comes in second. Yes, that undoubtedly has no place there. In order to create urine healthy kidneys, filter waste from the blood. And the third most common change is having foamy urine bubbles in the urine especially those that require you to flush several times before they go away, which indicate that unwanted protein is in the urine. Healthy kidneys filter waste from the blood to produce urine, but if the filter is damaged, blood cells may start to leak out into the urine. Like this video, share it with your friends so they can learn how to take care of their kidneys as well. And click the subscribe button to join us on your Health Matter channel. Have you ever had any of these symptoms before? If so, how did you handle them? Tell us in the comments area below. Thanks for watching and take care. Bye and I hope to see you on my next video. Please don't forget to subscribe.